The green life along the Mississippi River Delta can seem meaningless above the water, but the marsh is crucial to many forms of sea life. Lots of the other things that we value, like crabs and like shrimp, the things that we associate with coastal Louisiana, they really need the marsh. They really need to get up in that grass and get out of the way from the larger fish that are going to eat them. When the oil began making landfall, the Louisiana marsh grass soaked it up. University of New Orleans Earth and Environmental Sciences professor Denise Reed studies the impact. So if the marsh grass dies and you see the top of it go brown and dead, but if the roots also die, then that once the plant's gone, the roots are gone, there's nothing to hold the soil together and it essentially just washes away. And that's land loss. Reed says in some parts of the delta, marsh grass has been fighting for its life. And what we've seen in some areas is where the top of the plant has had a lot of oil on it, it's actually started to shoot up new green leaves. And that's because it wants to survive. So it's using its energy reserves in the soil to put up some new green leaves. But not all the marsh has come back to life, according to Reed. She's waiting until next spring to find out how much of the grass has been killed by oil and dispersant. That's when the grass starts a new life cycle. The reason that we're so worried about the marsh in Louisiana is that we have lost the ability to naturally regenerate marsh. Without the marsh, the ecosystem around Louisiana will be changed. Mark Carlson, The Associated Press, New Orleans.